Hey everybody, where are we? We are at the Murray State University Arboretum in Murray, Kentucky. You might be able to tell right away that the Inspire 2 has way too many cameras on it. You might have also guessed by the title of this video that we're gonna do some stabilization tests. This is the GoPro family over here. We got a GoPro Hero Black 7 on loan from I Am Wedge, thanks Doug. And then as a control, we have a non-stabilized GoPro Hero Session 5 over there. And then over here is the DJI family, the pocket which is mechanically stabilized, and the Action, the Osmo Action here, which is electronically stabilized. First and foremost, the plan is not to crash the Inspire. This should be an interesting test. All of the cameras except this one are stabilized in some way. And I'm curious to see which one will win the stabilization war. Uh, I'm also curious to see how the Inspire 2 will fare with this much weight on the front, right. which is the reason why I took off the main camera. There's no Inspire 2 camera there just to save on a little bit of weight. I'll be using this two axis gimbal here to fly. I'm not gonna go very far, but um, I, I'm confident that uh, we, we didn't do any practical tests. I'm, I just believe, I believe it'll work. I'm sure a lot of people are wondering how the Osmo Action is going to perform, but I'm most excited about seeing the uh, Osmo Pocket. It, it's never been airborne before, as far as you're concerned, right? Well, I've never put it airborne, but I think people have done it. Um, it, it doesn't make a lot of sense to do that, because right. the, the gimbal's not that strong. But we'll see how it goes when we start going a little fast in this thing. This so. is going to be awesome. One of the things I was happily surprised with is the fact that the Osmo Action clamp set can fit into all of the GoPro universe stuff. So this actually comes with the Osmo Action and it's got this really cool locking mechanism. It just, it twists on. Can you see that right there? Look, it just twists on just like that. It's really cool. Clearly Kelly's interested. Okay gang, we all ready to go. We got the Osmo Action. We got the Osmo Pocket. We got the GoPro Hero Black 7 and just for control, we've got the non-gimbaled, non-stabilized GoPro Hero Session 5. I, I think, think we're, we're ready. ready. Okay, we got about what, 11 grand about to go up. <laughs> Give or take a okay. few grand. Uh, you know, I'd feel a lot better maybe if I, hand, if I launched it from your hands. And oh then my. Lift, it, lift it high above your head. Am I clear on all fronts? You don't need your ring finger, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, you good? Oh, Needless to man. say, don't do don't this. Don't try this don't, at don't home. Don't do this. We are professional idiots. Are <laughs> right, you ready? Oh, gosh. Here we go. All now, right. don't let go until you feel it lifting you off the ground. Okay. All right, here we go. I'm going to start it. Yep. Here we go. All right, we did it. We did it. No injury. We bring it over here so I can see. Let's go over to the pond. I don't know, man. I'm not that confident. No, it's a little shake. Oh, sh land it, kid. What? 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 What happened? Oh, gosh. Yep, didn't hold. Oh, my gosh. Hey, have you got a drawing board? <laughs> <laughs> so you're probably wondering what happened. Yeah, what went wrong? Everything seemed perfect. We had it tight. We had it zip tied on strong. Yep. yep. You know what happened? I have no idea. <laughs> when it goes up to a certain height, the legs come up. <gasps> and when the legs come up, they separate. And when they separate, <laughs> it, it fell out of the it, slot. The board wasn't long enough. I'm so stupid. That was my mistake. That's all me. Woo. So I'm going to go into the software and make it so that the legs don't do that. And we'll be right back <laughs> after I console myself. <laughs> <laughs> so what did we learn? We learned that we, you, almost made a crucial mistake. Uh, yeah, yeah, I, I learned that you continue to be my good luck charm. No, I'm not your good luck charm. And that, uh, I am fallible, just like everyone else. I think I'm a jinx on the Inspire too. No, don't say that. Let's get some plastic to knock on. Okay. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna try it again as these people behind us walk by. <laughs> Clearly, they don't wanna ask us any questions <laughs> and they're gonna leave us alone because they know we're making a YouTube video. They just wanna so be here's on, the, the, on the channel. Here, here's the next step. You got it? Yep. 
Okay, you made me nervous there. You made me nervous. <laughs> it's my head. Okay, I think we're good. Okay. So far, so good. Let's head over to the water and hope that it goes better this time. We good? Yep. You know what? Ah, I don't know if I want to let it go that far. You know what I mean? It's kind of a risky shoot. It really is. You got a lot of weight on there. You've got yeah. uh, four different cameras. All right. So uh, we're bringing it over here. All right. If you're happy and you know it, wave your hands. <laughs> All right. We'll give it some some wobbles. Not too much. Back, forth, back, forth, up, down, up, round. I hope it's stabilizing good. <laughs> well, sorry, gram grammarians. <laughs> I hope that dumb thing stabilizing real good. <laughs> I, I tell you what. All right, let's land it. Yes, please. I'm very nervous. What's your plan on landing it? No idea. <laughs> Maybe a hand catch? Your hand or my hand? Because the cameras are down to the ground level. Yeah, they're below the legs, below the landing gear. Oh man. All right. Needless to say, you should never hand catch an Inspire 2 or 1 or anything this big. Yes, sir! What do you guys think? All right, all right, all right. So we haven't seen the footage yet from these cameras, but I'm assuming uh, some will be more stable than others. Uh, what is clearly unstable is my thought process <laughs> in uh, wanting to do this in the first place. It's not advisable. <laughs> Kelly, which one do you think did the best? Which one do you think performed the best? I mean, you can't go wrong with the Hero 7. I mean, the stabilization on that is incredible. I'm interested to see what the Pocket did. The Osmo Action's brand new, so this would be a great test for it to see if it can kind of hang in there with the 7. Of course, the uh, Hero Session 5, the Hero 5 uh, Session camera is probably going to be shaky as it'll be, shaky can get. It'll be shaky. Because like you said, that, that right. isn't built to do anything like that. I'm actually thinking that this, the, the Pocket, will have done the best. Well, I think a good way to end this video would be to put the regular camera back on the drone and uh, relieve it of all of its cargo duties. Use it for what it's made for. That's right. And we'll show you a, a little bit around, where are we again? The Arboretum at Murray State University. That place. Is there a little girl that would want to launch this drone? Me! Not you. Oh. Come on! <laughs> you can do it! All right. Just slide that over and it'll take off. Oh, you did it! <laughs> woo woo! Hey, good job! Very good. Good job. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Until next time, don't do what we did today. Buh and bye. So we're about to leave the Arboretum yes. when we happened upon this little mini-me library. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And uh, it's called the Arboretum. <laughs> <laughs> they threw a pun on you this time. Happily, they've got my favorite book in here. Yeah. 
Death of an Inspire 2. No, salesman. Ha <laughs> ha. Ooh, hey. Ooh, hey. Ooh, hey. <laughs> <laughs>